floating on that plane like that, and there's no way they can take over. Johnny's gonna be jealous. Oh my god! What are you doing here? I... I was supposed to leave with Angelo. So what's in here? Guns? Money? Some uncut shit? Shoes? Actually, they're this season's new... Bullshit! That's last year's fall collection. <laughs> That's not true. Just let it go, man. No reason to piss off Manuel. Let's get going. So, what am I supposed to do now? I don't fucking care. I have no place to go. C, answer A. But you can't just leave me here. Bitch, you're trying my patience. Can you at least tell me where Manuel is? I changed my mind. Shoot her. Good job, man. I'll tell Julius we're done here. Take Angelo's ride. I'll drive this back to your crib. You know what? I think Julius was right about you. Nice work. But I don't think I can let Julius go until you do a little more community service. We'll be in touch. Looks like we wait. Why? So we can let this jag off jerk us around? Fuck that! And what would you rather do? You know exactly what I'd like to do. Johnny, we're not blowing up City Hall. Hey, I'm just saying, it would solve a lot of problems. What if they're keeping Julius there? Alright. But there's gotta be a better plan than let's be Monroe's bitches. You're right. There is. Marshall Winslow was a major public figure. And you can bet your ass that people would ask questions if the chief of police wasn't at his funeral. I say we hit Monroe during the funeral procession. That's to show whoever he's working with that we're not fucking around. You're saying we should assassinate the chief of police while he's at the funeral of the guy we just smashed? Yeah. <laughs> Don't tease me, Dex. Let's fucking do it. The street. He'll be giving us cover if things go bad after the hit. Now let's get to the roof before the mourners roll by. Take this. When the funeral procession comes into view, take out Monroe. He'll be the one in the cop car. Let's get to forgive and forget. Consider yourself absolved. Herman Hughes. That was quite a message you sent at Winslow's funeral. And trust me, I heard it loud and clear. Now I'd like to set one thing straight. It was Monroe's plan to strong arm the Saints. Personally, I've always thought you and I could have a much healthier relationship. Now we've had a rocky start, yes, but why don't we fix that? Come over to my fundraiser tonight. Julius will be there, and between the three of us, I'm sure we can work something out. Your guest is here, Mr. Yos. Thanks, Stephen. If you don't mind, could you wait outside? I'm Richard Hughes. It is a pleasure to meet the man who handed me the election. No need to be modest, I'm serious. There's no way I could have beaten Marshal Winslow. God rest his soul. But you made the impossible happen, and for that, I can't thank you enough. I mean, had Winslow been the only person killed, attention would have definitely been cast on me. But after that fireworks display you pulled at his funeral, it's become abundantly clear these horrible crimes were perpetrated by the Third Street Saints. While before people criticized my Saints Row urban renewal plan, it is now being lauded. See, until you came along, I was displacing poor people. Now, I'm destroying a hotbed of gang activity. 
<laughs> what can I say? The public is fickle. Champagne. Oh, as you get older, you quickly learn that there are only two types of people in this world. Race, money, gender, none of this matters. At the end of the day, you're either a winner or a loser. Now, the sad truth about our situation is that in order for me to be a winner, I have to level your neighborhood and salt the earth. Hold on for a moment. Stephen, could you come in here? Where was I? Oh yes, salting the earth. Now, I suppose I could try to pay you off. But really, what's the point? You just say no. Or in your case, stand there looking intimidating and we'd be right back to where we started. So I figured I'd cut the middleman and get right to the point. Yo, can you speed this shit up? I want to go to Freckle Bitches. You're going to die here, son. Make no mistake about that. But if it makes it any easier on you, I'll be sure to thank you in my acceptance speech. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a party to... I could do something me-ish with that APC turret. Oh, Death is a door now. I'm so good, I surprised myself. Better what I blow up? Whatever could be blown up should be blown up. The more public, the better. There's a strip mall near you that will make a good target. This is the best day ever. Turn up the heat. Here, listen. Our goal at Marshall is to remove human error when it comes to the public safety. Then how do you respond to reports of a rogue tank wreaking havoc in the city? I say let a Marshall AI tank step in and stop it. How do you respond to reports that the rogue tank is in fact a Marshall AI tank? How dare you make false accusations? I'm gonna sue you, your paper, and your entire fucking family! Oh, <laughs> they're pulling him off stage. Oh, he looks pissed. Atticus, yo, dude, what's up? What do you want? No, I don't have time for this. Because of that Marshall tank busting up the city. What do you know about that? Oh, it's me. What? Yeah, we hacked your tank. It's been me the whole time. You son of a bitch! When I get my hands on you! You won't. Because I'm in your tank. Motherfuck! What the hell do you think you're doing? You're just in time for the vote. You think you could fire me? My family built this business! My name is on the goddamn building! Our stock price is rock bottom, and our shareholders want your head. It's the Saints! They exposed the frontier. They robbed my train. They ruined my good name! We've done the risk assessment, and you are a liability. Bullshit! This company's nothing without me! The motion is to terminate Atticus Marshall and appoint me chair of the board. All in favor? All opposed? You have a tie. Now what are you gonna do? Let's ask the tiebreaker. Atticus Marshall? You are fired. Get your hands off me! You haven't heard the last of Atticus Marshall! Yes, I'm sure we'll hear you hollering all the way down to the lobby. You held up your end of the deal. And now, so have I. The Saints are all yours. Thanks. We made a good team. Don't go mistaking us for friends. This was business. You interfere with Marshall again, and you'll get the horns. <laughs> 